Chumbi Stories. The Lion and the Mouse. Once there was a lion who lived in the forest. Known for his great strength and power, he ruled the land that every creature was afraid of him. One day, after drinking water, he went to hunt some food. Then he went fast asleep. Later, while the lion was sleeping, a mouse appeared. Uh? When he saw the sleeping lion right in front of his door, he was worried that he may not get into his house. He tried to get through by the lion's butt. Then... Then he realized that it was not a bright idea. He also tried digging in the dirt so he could create and go through a tunnel. But he realized he couldn't do it on his own, for he is way too small. The little mouse tried to think harder. If he could not pass through the lion by its side or by under it, maybe he could pass over it. So he climbed the tree right next to his tree house. However, while the little mouse went on climbing, he slipped on his foot and fell down. He landed on the lion's back and cried in pain. <coughs> he awakened the lion and he knew his plan failed. This brought him to disaster. <coughs> The lion was furious, and this made the poor mouse tremble. The lion was about to devour the little mouse, but he pled to spare his life. Oh, king of the forest, I have awakened your sleep. It was a mistake, and I ask you to pardon me. I will surely repay you in the future. The lion was surprised with the mouse's bravery. He freed him, so the little mouse went to his home. The following day, the forest was disturbed by a loud noise. Curious with the unusual sound, the little mouse went to see. Oh no! Loggers have threatened the animal's home! They cut down the trees! Furious with what he saw, the lion ran into them and cast them out of the forest. Ah! 
the next day, the lion went out to look for food. He saw a fresh juicy meat. Its enticing fragrance persuaded him. But it's a trap! The loggers have returned. The strong and powerful lion is now helpless. <laughs> Trapped in the net, the lion roared too loud. The mouse heard the roaring and thought the lion might be in danger. He thought to himself that he must help the lion. The little mouse remembered his promise. The little mouse began to chew the net. Soon, it was torn. Thank you for freeing me. Hop on my back, friend. The lion gladly thanked the little mouse, and they became friends. Soon, the loggers came, and they were confused how the lion got freed from the trap. Never underestimate anyone. There is no being so small that it cannot help a greater. Thanks for watching! If you want more awesome stories like this, please consider subscribing and liking the video. Hit the notification bell to get notified when a video is uploaded. Bye!